Airplane and airport sketches are one of the most quintessential urban sketchers must do's, and so today's video is going to be all about that. and um, on the plane and flying from Vancouver to London. Instead of wasting the whole day um, just sitting around at the airport, I think we're gonna do some airport sketching and I'm gonna make a video about sketching on the plane and in the airport. Drawing planes from the terminal has always been fun, and this tradition went all the way back to my first urban sketchbook, when I went on a trip to Singapore. And back then, I wasn't exactly comfortable with using color, so my sketches were always shaded using hatching. And this A380 was the plane that we took to go from Singapore back to Hong Kong. There are so many different models of airplanes I haven't drawn. My drawing slowly progressed from focusing more on the plane itself to focusing on the surrounding context to better tell the story as well. This drawing was done from the Hong Kong airport, one of the most beautiful airports I've been in. And because of that, I included some of the interior features as well. My drawing style has changed over time and I once experimented with a more comic-like layout. Here I tried to break the box with the plane to create a more dynamic drawing. Flights can get really boring quickly, and sketching helps me get through all of it. Drawing from my seat is something that I would always do especially on a long haul flight. And here is a really old drawing I did back on my trip to Tokyo. And back then I was trying to use color differently and paint using extremely bright colors. And this other sketch is done on my trip to Helsinki, where something went wrong with my weird watercolor and it behaved a little more like markers. Almost all of my plain interior drawings make use of curvilinear perspective to stretch my view and to put more information into the drawings. A simple way of thinking about this is changing to a smaller lens. Here from the seat looking straight, I can barely see anything other than the blank board, but by changing the lens, I am able to capture more into the same picture. Imagine this at a more extreme level, and then that's how I draw. this video gave you some good insight into how to draw at the airport or in a plane. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This drawing was done in Helsinki on restaurant day where people set up stands in the park to sell homemade food.